And for more about this latest national land survey and what it means, let's speak to our reporter Ying Yue, who has been following the story in Yue. So we have the data right now. China has about 135 million hectares of cultivated land. How shall we look at this figure? Yes, all right. Yeah, this 135 million hectares actually takes about 14 percent of China's total national territory. And this is a little bit higher than in previous survey that showed that in 1996, this percentage point was marked at around 13.5 percent. But this increase is actually not that significant, especially when we see it together with China's population growth, which grew at a rate of around 6.5 percent in 2002. And although it fell to around 4.8 percent in 2011, but given to the country's total population, this is still a very large number. So uh, the, uh, we can see from this data that China's agricultural sector hasn't seen any fundamental changes. And this is also why the Ministry of Land and Natural Resources have decided to maintain the strictest land policies in the future, just to ensure China's food security. Back to you. Okay, so uh, there's um, uh, at least some good news there. And you, I know that you have been speaking, uh, speaking to some experts. Tell us what did they say about their view on how China's agricultural situation is going to evolve in the future. That is besides the agreement on tight land policy. All right, but actually experts see a lot more than just this agricultural acreage. Or for example, besides how many hectares we can use to produce, it also matters how much each hectare produces. And recently one health topic related to, related to this kind of uh, land use efficiency is the transfer of land use. And experts see this as a long-term trend for China's agriculture. This, they, they think this is where China's agriculture is heading to. And besides experts, I've also visited some companies as well as some farmers. And companies actually, they've shown great interest in this kind of land uh, use transfer. They believe that by, by undertaking the land from farmers by contract, they can actually promote or develop their large scale uh, production. And also the farmers, especially uh, local governments, they also want to resort to more resources from companies, the investment, the capital, the technology and administration and everything to secure the uh, production. So these are just different aspects of this general concept of how to enhance the uh, land use land use efficiency. Back to you. Indeed, there have been uh, quite a lot of interesting talks about a transaction of rural land. Thank you very much, Ying Yue, on um, your latest update on the uh, rural area and China's arable lands. Uh